at the, the two different kinds of primer here, the Mad Dog primer and then the uh, the Mad Dog primer goes on definitely gray and after it's dry, been here a couple of days, um, it definitely has a, a tacky feel to it, which I know when you read the PDS it talks about um, that, that it will have that tacky finish and that's to help that paint bond to it versus where it definitely feels dry and more like a traditional primer coat. What we noticed is that the, the Mad Dog primer definitely covered everything up and helped glue things down um, in appearance a lot better than the, the um, you can still see a lot of the stuff coming through it and, and we add some some tint to the primer so that we can see where we've gone after it's, it's dried because typically this product is going to dry clear. Uh, we'll start getting a top coat on these and we'll see what they look like between the two. You can see here the Mad Dog primer has uh, just a better coverage this is a pretty beat up composite shakes versus this primer. Um, it just feels a little more rough compared to, to the Mad Dog. And that may be due to the, the Mad Dog primer's higher solid content. But we'll get a top coat on it and we'll see how it looks. You can see looking at the shed, you could hardly even tell that it even had an issue before. It looks excellent now. Shed's gonna last a lot of years. Put one coat of Mad Dog on it, Duralast primer, and then we put two coats of our top coat on there, which we used Resilience from Sharon Williams. So it's looking good, looking brand new. So there you have it, our shed is all complete now. We got our competitor product over here, our Mad Dog over here. They both look pretty similar. The shed looks uh, pretty new. Our Mad, Mad Dog uh, primer, primer is performed really, really well. As you can see at the beginning of the video, this was flaking and peeling really bad. And looking at it closely, you can't even tell that I had that issue now. The stuff has sealed it, it's glued it on there. It's gonna last a lot of years. We got two top coats on top of it, on top of that uh, Mad Dog primer. Really happy with the primer. Really like the fact that it's tinted and doesn't dry clear. The stuff is really good. Got to try it out, Mad Dog uh, Primer. If you've enjoyed this video, please consider giving me a thumbs up. 